Okay. So I've got some things which we're supposed to read before we do that, but I've also got some comments I'm going to make uh, before we uh, get into that. Um, I know there's people here tonight about a health textbook, and I know that a certain individual strung all that up with one fact and a bunch of lies. And the reality is this board's not voting on a textbook tonight. That textbook was shot down in a committee. We only vote when a textbook is brought to us that is being recommended. I will argue that that's actually better than some of the other school boards in the area where it made it all the way to the school board. And the school board had to cut it down. What it shows is that the people in our committee know our community and know that that book wouldn't fly. There is, a, a, you'll see in our agenda, there's an agenda item, you're welcome to set for that. What that is, is by law, we have to acknowledge that that committee met four times during the year and that we have minutes of those meetings. That's all we're approving. We're not approving a book. As a matter of fact, they're gonna use our old book. We may have to make some additions to it because the Texas government added some teaks, which we don't control. But it isn't gonna be the book that you were led to believe. I also struggle with anyone telling you how I'm gonna vote. No one in this room knows how I'm gonna vote but me. So that was an out and out lie. I can tell you I would vote no. I can't speak for the rest of the board members because it didn't come in front of us. So we didn't deliberate about it and we're not gonna be deliberating about it. But you guys need to know this is a conservative board. We've got a, a member of the community that really tries to prove that wrong on a constant basis. But the fact is, this is the board that was one of the first boards that got rid of masks as soon as our governor said we could. This is a board that stood up against critical race theory before the state did. This is a board that has the fourth, anybody that sat in here for the tax hearing knows it's a fact. The fourth lowest tax rate out of 24 districts in this area. We have the lowest debt per student of any district in this area. We run a balanced budget and we have one of the highest bond ratings. Everybody on this school board was elected. Elected in a conservative Montgomery County. We are all conservatives. Everybody on this board goes to church. The assertion that we're not church going people, I take offense to, especially when it comes from a person who says the things they do and then claims to be a Christian. Because I, I read the Bible and I go to church. And if it's my Bible that, I, that the other person's reading, I can promise you those things are not how a person behaves. So if you've signed up to speak about this book, you're going to be more than welcome to. You're going to be preaching to the choir because the book's not going to be adopted. And we're not going to be voting on it. And if you stay for that part of the meeting where they talk about what we are voting on, you will get a full explanation of that. So with that, I will start by reading that all participants must 